Today I'm going to be doing reviews. Um, I'm going to do two parts. I'm not really sure how I'm going to edit the video. But basically one part is going to be all about makeup and nail stuff. And the other one's going to be about um, like toiletry stuff. Okay? So the first thing that I'm going to review is um, Coastal Sense 88 Shimmer Palette. <coughs> Sorry. It's Coastal Sense 88 Shimmer Palette. It's really, really amazing. I love it so much. Um, hopefully you can see that okay. It's really gorgeous. It's $24 American. You can order it from Coastal Sense. It's very high quality, very affordable, goes on flawlessly. It's so beautiful. I love this. I, like, one of my favorite purchases of all time. I love this so much. Um, you can order it from Coastal Sense. It's $24 American. You can order it to Canada. It took me about five business days to get it to Toronto uh, from Florida. They ship it from. And, um, yeah, it's really, really awesome and I highly recommend Coast Sense especially if you're kind of starting out and you're going for more drugstore stuff to more expensive stuff and you want to um, have an affordable way to see uh, I don't know what, what you like what you use what colors you use what you actually think you're going to use and what you actually end up using okay so Coastal Sense is awesome um, and I also have some brushes if you guys want to I'll do a review about brushes also Okay, so everything else is going to be from a drugstore, um, from shoppers. I got everything from shoppers. If you're in the States, you can go to, like, Walmart or pretty much any drugstore. I think CVS or whatever you guys have over there. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to review is this Maybelline. I don't really know what the color specifically is, but the code on the back right here is WE165. So if you just look at the top, just to double check if you're not sure you're seeing these colors correctly. Um... It's really amazing for pale skin. I love this. I use it very often. Well, now that I have my Postal Sense 88 Shimmer Palette, I kind of never use this, but this is awesome. Um, I will always take this with me. I don't like to take my 88 Shimmer if I like go somewhere, so I'll take this with me a lot of times. Um, these two colors are amazing. This top right-hand corner color is like a gift from Jesus himself. Like, it's amazing. <coughs> Sorry. I, uh, had my birthday party last night, so I'm a little bit under the weather. Um, and the next thing I'm going to review is Lash Blast Mascara. This is awesome stuff. Um, <laughs> uh, I highly recommend it. It's really cheap. It's great. It's voluminous. It goes on easy. Um, yeah, it's really good. Um, <coughs> oh my gosh, guys, I'm so sorry. The next thing I'm going to review, I've mentioned this in like every video I've ever done, but if you haven't seen them, it's Rimmel's Natural Blonde Bronzer. This stuff is awesome. It goes on really, really natural looking. I pile it on in the summer and everyone thinks that I went tanning or like I have a tan, but I don't. It's completely fake. Um, for pale skin, if you have pale skin, oh my gosh, you need to get Sunlight 021. It's awesome. It looks so natural. It's just like... I buy this all the time. And sometimes it's on sale for like $3 at Shoppers. Okay, the next thing that I'm going to talk about is uh, just like a simple, cheap thing. Dove Go Fresh Body Mist and Energize. There's three different scents, but this is my favorite. And I actually noticed some girls at my work um, use this also. I um, what else? Kiss. If you're looking for, I really, I have fake nails on right now, but usually I always have my real nails, I'll file them. I can grow them really long sometimes, depending, like, how my health is and stuff. I bet. Not that I, like, have bad health or anything, but I just noticed if I'm really healthy, my nails grow better, so maybe it's just all in my head. Um, yeah, so I usually file my nails. I love Kiss the brand Kiss. This nail file is awesome. I've had it forever. It's really nice and it really doesn't like, if you do file your nails, your own real nails or maybe your fake nails too. I don't really like filing. So if you do file your own nails, this is really nice and has a really nice consistency on your nail and it lasts for a long time. Like, you know, if you use nail file, you'll know how annoying it can get and like when it wears down and everything. And it doesn't break at the edges. I notice sometimes like I'll like get 
really like close to my side and go like this and then after a while it'll like chip along that side this doesn't do this I've had this forever it's like really worn if you can see it not ever but like I don't know maybe in six months so that's awesome um also I have two nail polishes that I get complimented on a lot um one of them is for I love it for pale skin. I get complimented on it all the time for pale skin. It could be for really any skin tone, but especially, like, I have pale skin, so I don't know if it looks great on other skin tones because I don't really see it on other skin tones. But it's this L'Oreal... Oh, my gosh. I'm seriously blind, guys. I'm so sorry. Oh, no. You know what? I peeled off the back, and I don't have the color. Oh, jeez. I'm a bad whatever oh oh my god it's on the top I'm so blonde <sighs> seriously I'm so blonde guys that was a blonde moment blonde moment called it okay so it's 380 and I'm too it's called breaking curfew breaking curfew I'm so like literally I'm like almost legally blind without my glasses on like I barely pass my driving test with my glasses on, like, to be able to drive, so, yeah, I'm not just, I can, I can read, I just can't see. Okay, so, yeah, so it's 380 Breaking Curfew, it's a really, really gorgeous color, hopefully you guys can see this, um, it's so pretty, and it really goes on nice, and it's very, very nice on pale complexions but it's just like a really dark burgundy so if you're pale pick this up and if you're not and you just like the color I really think this could work with any skin tint. I think burgundy is a really versatile color. Okay this people compliment me on like 90 and I don't think anyone even cares what their skin tone is they're wearing this I don't really think this particularly looks great on pale people per se but everyone loves it it's a hit um, and I was wearing it in another video. I was wearing it in my NARS blush video and my gold brown burgundy video. So it's Green with Envy by Rimmel. Dries in 60 seconds, 819. It's this color. It's just like a greeny blue teal. It's really like a teal with green in it. It goes on really nice. Rimmel 60 second drying stuff is great. I wouldn't say it dries specifically in 60 seconds. Like, don't say it's your watch doing or anything, but it dries fast. Also, I did this on purpose. I obviously have fake nails on, and I waited till the end to let you kind of subconsciously decide what you thought of my nails already before I told you anything about them. There's a point to this. So, do you like them? Do you not like them? Do they look like Fran Drescher? What do you think? What do you think? What do you think? What do you think? Well, let me tell you. I wore these nails last night to my birthday party, and everyone, including my super, I wouldn't say judgmental, but hot and honest friend, will say that. She's really beautiful and very very blunt and if you don't look good she tells you as soon as you walk in the door she's like ah oh, you look so good blah 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 your nails look awesome da 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 going on and on and on about my nails and I'm like would you believe I bought them at Shoppers Drug Mart for $13 and they're press-ons look at them here I'll show you they're nailing design connection and this isn't really the way the packaging exactly came, but it came in this packaging. I'll show it. Like, this is really, like, what you need to be focusing on. I got it at Shoppers. I don't think it's a specifically a Shoppers brand, but I heard that Kiss brand is really awesome for fake nails, too. And, you know what? I tend to believe it because I love their... <coughs> everything else I've ever used from them. So it kind of comes like this. Yeah, I'll kind of try and show you. Oops, except I did it like all upside down. But like they come with like, you can see all the nails kind of like just sitting along here in this like packaging that looks like this. <coughs> um, and they have different tips. I just got the plain French tips. They have lots of different varieties of tips. 
and they also have like fun Halloween ones too. And they are a lot longer. I filed them down. They filed down so well. I was shocked. Shocked. I was shocked. I'm so easily shocked. How well they filed down. It was very, uh, I couldn't have asked for them to file. I think they maybe even filed better than a natural nail. If that's even possible. Like, it was great. So they filed down really nicely. You can file them however long or short that you want. Um, you can kind of see, like, my thumbs aren't exactly the same size because I'm a human being and I make mistakes. So, yeah. Um, sorry, I just, like, have a bit of a cold. Yeah, I'm back. So, yeah, so that's my, um, like, makeup-y nail, po nail, nail polish review of some things that I have, things that I'll buy again, and I recommend to you.